Hey guys, Preston here, and the 6 and 1 Giants will be facing off the 6 and 1 Bulls. We can facing against the Bulls in our ninth week of the season today for the Giants season. If you couldn't tell already, there, there's a little there's a little issue we got here with the um, Windows Live Movie Maker or the Elgato itself. Because, well, something went wrong with it, and the frame rate gets messed up at times, and the screen goes a little bit blurred, so it, it's a little messed up, but. We'll have to deal with it, but that's not what we're going to talk about today. Because we're, as you can see right now, just terrible. I can't, there's no way I could fix this. So, so we're going to be talking about a little bit of RBI Baseball 2014 today. Just been announced a couple of days ago that there is going to be a baseball game for the Xbox One and uh, the other, other consoles themselves. So it's always nice to hear because the cancellation of MLB 2K13 isn't very good so far because, well, I'd be, I'll be, I would be playing MLB 2K13 if there wasn't another baseball game on the system itself because, well, there's really nothing else. And it's always exciting to see a new baseball game developer actually going to be playing this game because I, I always like some change. And I, th and I think they're a part of the MLB themselves, so it would be nice to see what they can actually do, see if they can compete with the show or actually maybe be the show. It's always a possibility, though. So it's always going to be nice to see that. I, they haven't really made a game since like the 90s and 80s, so it's gonna be a little. It's gonna be curious in what they're actually gonna be making so far. Some things I would like to see would be updated player stats, some nice um, pictures of all the players and their uniforms and stuff. Cause well, that's cause a big main issue of MLB 2K13 itself, that most of the players weren't even like actually in the game. I saw you see some nice stadium details in the Xbox One because, well, it's a next-gen console and I expect a lot better graphics and details and all that kind of things that I uh, should really need in a baseball game. I mean, it's the little things that really count in games at times. So I always want to see that happen. Some other things I want to see is some nice graphics at least. I mean, LB 2K13 really didn't have any good graphics at all, which I kind of actually want in a baseball game. I've never actually played the show and just, just looking at the show, it looks... 10 times better than, actually 100 times better than the actual MLB, MLB 2K13 and the 2K series in general. So that's basically things I want from the game, but this is the things I'm actually think, things that are going to happen. I think it's going to be a subpar game. I don't think it's going to be the best game around. I think it's going to be better than MLB, the MLB 2K series, what they've been, they've been producing this whole entire time. I expect more than, better than that. But not really that great. But next year, I, I think if they do continue the series, they can make a very good t game next year because, well, they would have some, some experience and I feel like they can just move up from this. They can go in the upscale for just creating a better baseball experience for the baseball fans on the Xbox One and Xbox 360. So there's always a possibility that they can compete with the show at some point. So we'll see how that's going to go. So, MLB 2K13 is slowly dying. This is also part of a channel update. So, so um, yeah, you haven't really been seeing MLB 2K13 of the New York Yankees franchise so far, and that's kind of well because the series is kind of dying out until March, where the where the baseball picks up again. Because I don't really want to bore you with some baseball, and when it's just dead winter, and no one really cares about it so much. So, not much of baseball. We're gonna be posting more Jeff Stripes videos because well, that's always a fun thing to do. Because well. It's it's base, it's basketball season basically right now, and I always like to play basketball in that game. The game's really fun, especially Jeff Stripes. There's a whole entire atmosphere, and I like I like the next gen console for it. So, also Madden, it's still gonna be going strong. This is if you can't really notice, this is like the series I post on my channel right now. It's the uh, most fun I ever had. I might be doing another Madden series. I uh, might be doing actually a GM series of the Oakland Raiders maybe, or um. A GM series of any any game in general, because um, those are always best to have right now. Because I just like controlling the team from the outside perspective, and not actually controlling the team inside. I just or playing the game. I just like managing the team, how they're going to be running and everything. So that might be fun. Might be a possibility we'll be using in the future, maybe a couple, a week or two. But it's going to be on next gen system because I want to have at least one, at least a Madden game or two on the next gen system. Even though it might not be the best, but it is kind of fun, a different experience to use. And I'm going to have to eventually get used to Madden 25 on the Xbox One and PS4 on the whole entire new system they have. So better start early. So some other series, Walking Dead, I'm going to be posting that soon uh, when they. It'll be released a new episode, which will be in the next month or two, somewhere around there. 
that's gonna be fun posting some of that nothing really else I mean Jerry Jr. Jr. series actually kind of dead and if you couldn't really notice I haven't posted that in a couple of months now so we're gonna, that's gonna be dead right now so right now we have the Yankees franchise we have the Madden series we have Jeff Stripes and that's always nice to have a couple we, I like to have um, a couple main series it's always fun to have well because I like to focus on the specific main series because other channels uh, not like mine or somewhat like my sports series they post a lot of sports videos from NCA to Madden to baseball to to um well, base to basketball and golf whatever sometimes and hockey it's always hard to keep up with that so it's always fun to just have my main series that I want to post right now so right now we're going to late February right now and it's always fun to, to experiment with some series, trying out new things. I um I, my original plan was to actually move this giant series over to the Xbox One, which didn't actually happen because well, Xbox Xbox One didn't really please me too much with the Madden series, and I don't really want to. I like this series too much to actually like ditch it. I'm actually doing a my player in the Madden series. If you really want that kind of stuff on this channel, always fun to see kind of things like that. Maybe doing a QB or running back, so the sign if I want to even do Mad series, so comment down below if you want to see some of that. So back to the gameplay. We're winning twenty one to ten, so very nice game. We're both six and one at the time, so it was very it's a very close matchup. I think it's raining at the time, or was raining at the time. So it was always fun to use. So nothing really much going on right now for the anything other series I want to do. Uh, oh yeah, I also play. I also post some Call of Duty Ghosts at time to time, which I'm kind of mad that they kind of deleted the heavy duty game mode, which I basically brought me back into the game. I don't know why they would delete it and replace it with Gun Game. I don't know if Gun Game is really even that valued in, in the game itself. But whatever, because I did get back into Call of Duty in general, so it is kind of fun for me again. Which hasn't really been the issue. <laughs> this is just fun watching the video from this view because it's just terrible. I don't even know what's wrong with the Elgato at this time. It's just screen tearing the whole entire time. Uh, I think that's fixed in the next couple of things I recorded because I recorded all these things in mass recordings, and I don't know why, but it would just it just wouldn't work. It's not. I don't think it's Movie Maker now. I think it's the Elgato that actually had the problem, but I think it fixed it so far. Like unplugging it and stuff, so that should be fixed around. I'm just really disappointed about this and how bad the quality is going to be. Without, this is not up to my part, but I don't, I, I don't really have another save file to actually play this game. And I already came too far to editing. Also, Movie Maker didn't really like... It, it was hard editing this video itself because it kept delaying every time I cut a clip in and actually like replacing it. And and uh, that's how I, if you don't know how to edit, I just cut the clips I don't need and then I just combine them all together. Which the clips I do need to see the field goal kick off stuff like that I cut out what you don't want to see so stuff like so it's I don't get what's I don't get what's wrong with it so we're up by 31 and 10 in the fourth quarter and they're doing pretty good the Bills are not they're not giving up I give them credit for that they do score a touchdown on that play it's now 31 to 7 it, 17 some clips I couldn't just even record because it would just be a it would just be a giant like screen frozen. So some clips you can't really see at all. It, it, David Wilson is having a very good game. He has over 100 rushing yards at the point. So usually picking up his game in his last couple of games, as the Giants themselves and they're on the six game winning streak. I don't actually know how far the series is gonna go. We're in our second season, and we're gonna finish our this season by I would say maybe middle to end of March so in that time I'm definitely gonna start a third third one up a third um season up but when then but when RBI baseball comes out I'm definitely gonna pre-order it and get it for the Xbox one have day one coverage of it so Madden is not gonna be the main series for too long maybe a month or two so it's gonna be my secondary series it's gonna be what now the Jeff Stripes series are Jeff Stripes um, I'm hoping to be I'd say it's going to be my third series, which is going to be not post too often, but it's still going to be there to be noticeable in the game. Because I do like playing NBA basketball and stuff. I'm not going to be doing my jam or my team or whatever that kind of stuff. Because I just think that just be adding too many series to this channel, that's too complicated. Because Jeff Stripes is simple, it's easy, and it's fast. And that's what I like about it, because you're focusing on one player, not focusing on a team. And we do miss a field goal. I mean, Josh Brown hasn't missed a field goal in a couple of years now, and he just missed one. That's kind of pathetic. So at this point, we're up 34-17. to We're looking good. 
If we do win this game, which we most likely will, we will be on a seven game winning streak. We lost our first game at home, first game at the Seahawks. So we're doing pretty good so far. So we're going to run out the clock right now. They failed the fourth down conversion and we are going to win this game 34 to 17. Very nice victory over the Giants. Not very good quality. I mean, I I'm sorry about that. I'll fix that later. So Giants are really doing great, honestly. Seven game winning streak and I think next week we're going to be facing, I don't even know what team we're going to be facing. So if you like guys like the video, my name is Preston. I'll see you guys later in my next video, which will be tomorrow. It'll be some Jeff Stripes videos. So that's pretty much it, guys. So see ya.